Hey there guys, welcome back to Anthony Vlogs, where Anthony Vlogs. And we have a bit of a different video going on for you today. I actually just got a package in the mail from a good friend of mine, Frank Ireland. You may know him as Chief Brody Rules. Uh, as you may or may not know, back last year, was it? Yeah, last year. Wow. It's been a year. Uh, my friend, Kirk Beatty, Shades at Night, sent me essentially what was like a, uh, a half joke but half honest uh, parody of like a loot crate or anything like that. I apologize if you hear background noise. I've got a, a uh, dishwasher running and an, a person working on the computer. But either way, uh, since then, our buddy Frank has done the same to other people and I went, you know, I sent one back to Kirk and it's been really fun, but recently it was my birthday and so Frank timed it pretty well to line up with my birthday here. So I have a package and I'm very, very, very excited. So let's go ahead and get my live reaction. I have no idea what could be in here. Now, if you guys watched Kirk's video where he opened Frank's package, it was, and I'm already seeing stuff, he references things that like we don't even remember saying. So that's, that's, it's ridiculous. Like I'm often told I have a computer brain that's just references, but Frank's like, like even more so, which is, which is great. Okay. <laughs> what am I supposed to, ah! Oh, so that's what you did with it. Great. Um, so here we have Rey from Star Wars. Um, this is her in her classic jumpsuit attire, complete with Ghost Build-A-Figure. Um, if you guys remember, the Ghost is actually the name of the ship from Star Wars Rebels. So that's pretty cool. Um, but it looks, you know, Rey doesn't look too much like Rey. She looks a bit more like uh, the lady from SNL, Kristen Wiig. So that's weird. Uh, Toys R Us exclusive, you know, rip Toys R Us, but really cool. I like it. I like the packaging. It's nice and beat up and broken, and it looks like it was on clearance. So great. A lot of cool Star Wars logos, a lot of neat stuff. If you look on the back, you can see other characters you can get. Super, super neat. Um, this is, I don't know if I want to keep this in the packaging or not. I probably will, but look at her eyes. That's, whew, that's bad. Not so good a paint job. But hey, Star Wars is awesome. I love Star Wars. I love all the movies. I love all the toys. So this is really cool. That's a joke. I don't like Star Wars at all. Speaking of Star Wars, we have an art... Wait a minute. <laughs> Wait a minute. What do I look at? <laughs> so we have R2-D2 Pest Dispenser, but if you look, it's a Justice League box? It has the Justice League logo and all their, the superhero logos, and on the back it says get Aquaman, Superman, Batman, and Wonder Woman. But it's RTD2. I mean, is this a crack at, at Cyborg? What is this? I don't understand. But I love it. Um, yeah, okay, cool. I, uh, that's definitely keeping the packaging. That's a rare, uh, a rare item, the trash can Cyborg. Cool. Um, well, the thing I screamed at earlier was this huge ass. Now, I don't know what I'm going to do with them. Mr. Incredible. <laughs> so I have this huge Mr. Incredible doll now. Because if you guys follow Frank on social media and everything, he was like, oh, I want that Elastigirl, but I don't know what I'd do with the Mr. Incredible. And apparently he just fucking gave it to me. Um, so he's like, it's your problem now. So now I have this this big uh, Bill Parr. Is that his name? Bob Parr. His name's not Bill. His name's Bob. Um, he has elbows. And I like this metallic suit. I don't know, I, I guess I have this now. That's pretty cool. See, the movie is really about him, which is the funny thing. So everyone's like, oh, it's a, it's a, it's an Elastigirl movie. Look, she's going on her own adventures. But all the trailers are this guy, Mr. Momming it up. So like, what the fuck? I'm just saying, it's a little hypocritical. It's Disney fucking having their cake and eating it too. Being like, oh, this character is gay or pansexual, but we're not gonna put it in the movie. That way everybody wins. This is ridiculous, but you know what? Where's his mask? That's a bit of a bummer. Either way, Mr. Incredible, coming at you in theaters, June, whenever it comes out. I don't know when it comes out. So we have this cup here, which is really, really cool because I have a figure of this, but now I have a cup of it too. It is uh, DG himself from the hit film Batman and Robin, Chris O'Donnell. Um, it has a picture of his bike, and then a picture of him uh, as as Dick Grayson, DG, and then a picture of him as Robin, and it's got Taco Bell on it, which, oh, there's really dusty in there. <laughs> this is cool. Um, I, got, I, got, I got a nice Dick cup, and I'm happy with it, so that's really cool. 
I can put this next to my figure. So I like that. Okay. Ow. It poked me. Whoa! Look at this! Electra! <laughs> it's a little, like, pin. That it's, it's Electra. It's Jennifer Garner's Electra from the hit film Daredevil. Not from her Electra film, but from Daredevil. Um, and it has the date February 14th, 2003 on Valentine's Day. Bummer. Get it. Um, so that's cool. I'll, I'll have this somewhere, maybe. I don't know what to do with that. Okay, there's more stuff in here. I gotta make sure I put this pin right. There's more stuff in here. What is this? <gasps> Whoa! Whoa! What's this? It's a Goosebumps, like, tin! Sponsored by Reese's. But it's Goosebumps, but it's like classic Goosebumps. It's a book storage vault. So let's see if there's goose. No, oh, there's no. I don't think there's any goosebumps in here, but still, this is cool because I love. I love me some goosebumps. I love me some, some, uh, some goosebumps, which is real good. Uh, so that's great. I, I'm glad with that. But what is this? It's like a a push pop, but it's got the Green Goblin on it from Spider Man. That's cool. Oh, that's really cool. I like that. Sweet, Green Goblin is so cool. Uh, yeah, anyways. Great. Push pop. Uh, we got some WWE cards. Women's division specifically. Look for autograph kiss cards, shirt and mat relics, and more. Well, guys, it's it's an unboxing, so we have to go ahead and get this opened up. So let's see what cards we got. Uh, you know, the rule move. Let's see. Let's see what we got. Uh, I'll show the cards. We got Ivory. Put them over here. We got Naomi. I like Naomi. Becky Lynch. I like Becky Lynch. Stephanie McMahon. Nikki Cross. Ooh. Cool. Kathy Kelly. I like Kathy Kelly. And then there's like these sideways cards where we have Bailey defeats Nia Jax retaining the NXT Women's Championship from almost three years ago. Okay. We have Ruby Riot versus Nikki Cross, Trish Stratus versus Mickey James, and Asuka versus Nikki Cross. They're just they're just versus like cards. They're not very special. I want an autograph card. Uh, Mickey James. Your music's fun. Uh, Tamina. 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 Remember her? Where's she at? Uh, Beth Phoenix. We got Bailey defeats Sasha Banks in a 30-minute Iron Man match. A lot of Bailey victories in this pack. Ember Moon, very cool. Nikki Bella, boo. Charlotte Flair, and Natalia. So a whole pack and no Alexa Bliss, so that was a fucking waste, Jesus Christ. Um, this is the lid, I assume, to the, the DG cup. Let's see if it fits. If it fits, it ships. It fits, it's the lid. It looks like we have like a Superman Returns, it's specifically Superman Returns, you can tell by the logo. Uh, it's like an armband? Let's see if it, I don't want to rip it. Oh, that's meant for a child. I don't want to rip that, I'm not going to put that on. Okay, what else we got in here? This is so packed, dude, like, oh my god. What is this? Oh. Whoa! Justice League stickers! It's Lex Luthor. He's bald, and he's back, and better than ever, so... That's cool. I like a good Justice League sticker. I can stick that on something. Or not. Maybe leave it in its, its packaging. <laughs> it's a sticker, Anthony. Okay. Uh, ooh, we got the other one. So to complete the set, we've got Daredevil, the, the, the little pin. Uh, so I'll go with the Electro one. That's cool. What is this? Manta Ray. See, this is what I mean. This, this is a reference to something, maybe. I don't know. Maybe it's because I watched his, his live stream on Instagram with the fish? I don't know. He, he referenced things that are like completely beyond me because they're from, you know, they could be from yesterday, they could be from two years ago. From one comment, but I mean, sure. Oh, say cheese and die? Oh, fuck me. Awesome. So we got the goose Goosebumps. I was called them Goosebumps Busters. Uh, goosebumps, say cheese and die, which is one of the best uh, covers because it's just a bunch of skeletons at a cookout. So in this one, it's basically there's a camera, and if you take a picture of somebody with the camera, they die. 
or if you take a picture of like an object, like if you took a picture of a car, the next day the car would be totaled. Um, so that's what this is. This never happens in the book or the episode of the TV show. It's just a way to I guess get you to buy the book. How was that? So Goosebumps, I like it. I'm glad there was a Goosebumps book in here. What was this, Angels in the Up? Oh my goodness, it's The Scout with Brendan Fraser. I like Brendan Fraser. Um, I've actually never seen this movie, but I like baseball and I like Brendan Fraser, so maybe it was time that I've seen this. There's the Mr. Incredible mask. Was it originally glued on? Hold on a second. Is that your mask or is that someone else's mask? This looks like it goes to somebody else. Unless it goes to him. I can't tell. Oh wait, no, it goes to him. It just like came off. It kind of, it's kind of on. That's weird. Is that supposed to do that? I don't know. But the Scout on DVD. Cool. Uh, that's all for the Goosebumps tin, so that's awesome. Oh, is there another pack of cards, or is that the, the trash from the last one? No, that's the trash from the last one. <laughs> Anthony, you're an idiot. Uh, what is this? Oh, it's from the card, deck of the BBC. Uh, I see Lex Luthor. Oh, this is so cool. This is the Superpowers uh, Lex Luthor figure. Oh, that's so cool. He's got like, what is this, karate chop action? Chop, 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 chop. How are you doing that? Oh my goodness, this is awesome. This is like a legit older figure, so this is like an actual present. Oh, fuck. That's so cool. I'm totally putting that with my other Lex Luthers. That's awesome. Is this removable? I don't want to try. Awesome. Thank you, Lex. Ah, uh, Sex Luther. Oh, 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 Sex Luther. Awesome. Let's sit him down over there. I'm saying awesome a lot, but because it is. What the fuck? You gave me a goddamn Sasquatch arm? <laughs> this is the build a figure piece and he just gave it to me I don't need this uh, okay let's see what else is in here there's there's still stuff oh there's still stuff uh whoa what is this what is this is this is like DC Comics revised this is an authentic reprint of the Brave and the Bold number 28 okay so it's like the first appearance of the Justice League which is cool so this is not an original, obviously, as I just read. It comes with a little authentication piece. But it is a reprint of Brave and the Bold, number 28, which is the first appearance of the Justice League of America. So you've got Green Lantern and The Flash and Aquaman and Wonder Woman and Martian Manhunter fighting Starro the Conqueror. So that's cool. I like the Justice League. What is this? Nickel City Con. This is just like your, your like fucking thing. Be like, I went to the Nickel City Con and now you get this. Uh, it's got like a little like, almost looks like it's drawn in crayon, like, cover of like the guests. That's kind of neat. I like that. I like conventions. Okay, what else we got in here? Whoa, I see Spider-Man comics. Ah, cool. Okay, so we've got uh, the Spider-Man number one from the 90s. I think it's from the 90s, late 80s, early 90s, around that time. Uh, when when uh, McFarlane was working on Spider-Man, if I'm not uh, mistaken. Yeah, so this is like reprinting a billion or whatever, but it's cool looking. Uh, there's some sort of Casper puzzle. So there's this movie called Casper, and it stars Bill Pullman, and uh, this is a puzzle for that live action film. It's a dollar, so money will spend on that. <laughs> yeah, sure, why not? Got a lot of comics, which is cool. Um, I like comic books. What else we got in here? The hell is this? Buffalo Bills game day. Who's Russ Brandon? This guy looks like Ron Howard. Sean McDermott. He looks kind of like Ron Howard, kind of. Anyways. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's continue. Um, what is you just throwing stuff in here? What is this for? Some sort of digital movie code? Doesn't even tell me the movie. And Avery. I don't know. I don't know what the movie is. Uh, let's see. Ooh, what's this? Is it like a book? <laughs> is it a book, Anthony? Oh, it's like a little, it's like a mini comic book, A Mask of the Phantasm. Oh, let's see if the best part's in here. Left, left with dad. Too young. Need time. Forget about me. 
It's actually in the book. That's the best part of the movie, is when he comes out of the cave and Alfred gives uh, Bruce the note of uh, Andrea leaving. He goes, you need time. Forget about me. Is there the part where he goes, Andrea's father. <laughs> awesome. Anthony, you say awesome too much. Okay. A an exciting original story of Superman, Last Son of Krypton by Elliot Magan. Special bonus 16 page album photographs from Superman the movie. What is this? What is this? It's some sort of like Superman. It's like an original story, not based on the movie, even though it's advertising the movie on the cover? I don't know. I don't read books, but I may read this because it's Superman. First in Warner's new series of Superman novels. Sure. Okay, let's see what else we've got in here. Whoa. Oh, oh, yay! Oh, cool. Okay, sweet. Oh, I can't open this though. All right, so this, this was a sticker sheet of some kind, or a, st a storybook sticker album that Frank found in Toys R Us recently, like within like the last couple weeks, because Toys R Us is closing down and they're just pulling whatever they have out of their warehouse to get it out. Um, and so they had this, and he made a video about it, and I was like, well, that's really cool. Uh, but. But he sent it to me, and that's that's awesome. Stickers made in Italy. Very cool. Um, I can't open it because it's like it's iconic. I don't know. Maybe I will open it. Tell me down in the comments below. Should I open this? No. I don't know. I heard a no from the the peanut gallery, so I don't I don't know. Very cool though. That's awesome. I love Spider Man. Oh yeah, boy! Return of the Jedi with a big old jump of the hut on there. What a speed Oh, is it just like, oh, uh, it's, yeah, it's just like a kid's book with pictures. Let's see if they have the part where he says, you know, he used to live here, you know. We're gonna die here, no, convenient. Ah, uh, it doesn't look like it is. It does have the part where he says. Oh, but it cuts out part of the dialogue. It says, Java, Luke called out as he, as he teetered at the edge of the plank. Free us or die. Do you guys want to like an intense reading of this book? I know all the, the voices and everything. So that's cool. Here we go. Here's Obi-Wan. Obi-Wan meets Luke as a ghost. Then the Emperor has already won, said Ben. You were our only hope. Yoda spoke of another, said Luke. The other he spoke of is your twin sister, said Ben. But I have no sister, said Luke. Ben explained to Luke that the identity of his sister was kept a secret to protect her from the Emperor. Then, by some inner sense, Luke suddenly realizes who his sister was. Leia, he exclaims stunned. Leia's my sister. I like how it says, <laughs> then by some inner sense, I don't know, whatever it is, the Force. Very cool. I love Star Wars Return of the Jedi. It's my favorite Star Wars movie, so that's very, very awesome to have. All right, we've still got some stuff in here. I think this may be the last of it. Um, whoa, more Superman Returns stuff. We have Life Cinnamon. It's a cereal box. Whoa, there's even cooler stuff on the back. It's for Superman Returns, and on the back, there's like all these little cutouts. Uh, it's a matching game, so you have different little pieces to match. You know, like where you flip all the stuff upside down and then you flip over pieces until they match. Um, you see if you can do it the quickest to see if you remember where they're at. And so you get Clark Kent, Lois and Superman, Jimmy Olsen, and the Daily Planet. So I'm so glad Jimmy Olsen is featured. That's sweet. I love that. Uh, so that's awesome. Um, I, oh, no, there's more. <laughs> oh, there's movie bills. What is this? Movie bill Avengers Infinity War. <gasps> Q&A with Sebastian Stan. Explore the gauntlet. Architects of Infinity. Visual Virtuso. Virtuso. Something fell. Pause, was that you? Get it? Uh, so there's a Q&A with Sebastian Stan in here, so that's really neat. His logo is his arm. That's funny. After the Winter Soldier caused a rift in the Avengers ranks, Sebastian Stan talks about collaborating with the good guys for a chance, or for a change and reflects on his time in the MCU. Well, Ray, you finally have something to read. I hope you're happy. Yay! Awesome. Um, and then there's a playbill for the Lion King. Well, now we have two. All right, let's see. Uh, it looks like I'm, I'm digging around to make sure because you never know. It looks like there's one more item, and what an item to end it on. Good Lord. 
It is the Amazing Spider-Man Lizard Pez. Um, so there he is. There's the lizard from Spider-Man. Oh, Peter Parker. That one. And there he is. That's that's all it is. I don't know what to say. Uh, but anyways, guys. Oh my goodness. This is this is ridiculous. I have so much stuff over here, and I don't even know what I'm gonna do with half of it. Half of it I'm gonna throw away. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'm, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Um, so that's it. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I have a, I have a, I have time to collect more items for a certain someone, so I can return the favor. Anyways, guys, see ya. Take care.